Hey Panthers fans, Jordan Rodriguez with the Charlotte Observer here. Now, I hope you all are having a great week, but I know for a fact that Steve Wilkes is having an excellent week. He was just hired on Friday as the new defensive coordinator for the Carolina Panthers. Obviously, he was a secondary coach before, has great experience with the team, with the players, with building a young secondary, was crucial in developing this defense over a five-year span, and has worked with Rivera for a long time. This is honestly the best possible situation that the Panthers could find themselves in. Now, they do need a secondary coach, but Steve Wilkes said they already have a few names in mind, and in a couple days, the Panthers will have a new secondary coach and be ready to head full steam ahead into the offseason. I can tell you I'm extremely excited about this opportunity to become the defensive coordinator of Carolina Panthers, and um, I've been a part of this defense for the last five years. I uh, feel like I've had a major part in the input in shaping this defense and doing the things that we're doing today. Um, I congratulate Sean for the opportunity that he has. As I sat around and I talked to all the defensive coaches earlier, I was telling those guys that, you know, this wasn't Sean's defense. This was our defense, and we all had a hand in it. I think the best part of Steve Wilkes' press conference on Friday was watching his appreciation for not only where he is now, but where he came from. Over 20 years ago, he was the defensive coordinator for Johnson C. Smith, a tiny university just down the road from Bank of America Stadium, where he did everything from coaching the players on the field to cutting the grass and washing clothes, doing all the little things to make sure he one day would get his opportunity, and now it's here. Over there cutting the grass, washing the clothes, and dreaming of this opportunity one day, having a chance to coach here with the Carolina Panthers. So I'm extremely excited. I'm looking forward to the, uh, the challenge and the opportunity. And as I said before, uh, we're going to continue to do the things we've been doing in the past. How much did you make at Johnson C. Smith? Uh, you know what? It's been so long ago, I can't remember, but it wasn't much. <laughs>